We have an exciting announcement that we want to make. We've been talking about uh, adding an additional campus, a multi-site approach to ministry. We've been talking about that for the past several months. And uh, today we are kind of going pub public with uh, where that's going to be. And Pastor Joel, is go who's a campus pastor at that campus, is going to join me on stage. But as he comes to do that, I want you to watch this video and you'll kind of see where we're headed. <laughs> Hey, Journey Christian, we're excited to come to you today with our announcement. I know that many of you have been praying about and wondering what's going on with our multi-site efforts. Well, today we're announcing the fact that we are landing in the middle of Lake County, uh, and specifically Mount Dora High School is where we're going to be having our Sunday morning worship experience uh, for Mount Dora. And so that is uh, the big announcement for today. We've got offices that we're working at getting put together and we're going to be landing out here. So your prayers are continuing to be answered, and we are excited to announce January 2014. We'll be launching our first multi-site here, right here in this auditorium, uh, to reach more folks in Lake County and Mount Dora. Amen. We're excited about that. It is amazing, people see that video, and it, it looks like we're filming that right here in this auditorium, doesn't it? It's amazing how much that auditorium at Mount Dora High School looks like this uh, auditorium here, doesn't it? Yeah, it's, it's about the middle two sections here. About, it seats about 500, yeah. so it's, it's pretty eerie and cool how God works like that. So. Yeah, that's a 10-year-old that's a building. Uh, there as well, that auditorium. This is a 10-year-old building, so it's just, uh, yeah. just cool how that kind of lined up. Why, uh, Joel, let's talk a little bit about why we headed out west, and the uh, campus is going to be called Journey Christian Church West Campus. So uh, why do we head out uh, toward Mount Dora? Well, what we looked at initially was where are our people currently coming from, and obviously there's a big group that comes from right around the church in Mapopka and Altamont, but there are pockets that drive quite a ways to get here, and so we looked at those different places and tried to get some inroads in, looked at some facilities and different things, and the doors just kind of opened for us to head out to Mount Dora. So we did our due diligence, and then we just prayed, and God opened the doors for us to head out there. So we've got a group of a little over 200 that come from Lake County, uh, Mount Dora area. We sent out letters this past week, about 91 letters to households just letting them know that we were coming up. It was a couple weeks ago, I guess, we sent those letters. Yeah, out, so. yeah, we wanted to give the folks who live out there who drive, and if you're driving from... I just met uh, several folks today from Eustis and Tavares and, and, of course, Mount Dora and all in that area. And they say, hey, that's, that's so cool. That's going to be out closer. The church, the experience that they've come to love here in church family. And they drive, and they've been driving, uh, some of them uh, 30 minutes, 35 minutes or further to, to get over here to this. But to be able to have that experience of your church and your community. Let's talk a little bit about that multi-site experience. And what do we mean by that? Yeah, it, it's basically a, a strategy to accomplish the vision of the church, the overall vision of Journey Christian Church, and that is to reach more people uh, in the neighborhoods that you come from. And so it's a love your neighbor as yourself mandate from Christ to reach out to those around you. And so we felt like we could do that through multi-site effort, which basically means that we're taking what we love about Journey Christian Church and trying to implement that in a different community, uh, being Lake County and Mount Dora. So Sunday morning will look a lot like it does here. Um, everything on the stage will be done live uh, and in person except for the preaching aspect. So the sermons and the messages from the Word, those will be coming through a video live simulcast yeah. from this place, yeah. from the stage here, uh, out there. So, uh, so when we're speaking here, if I'm speaking or Joel or someone else, what, what, what we're experiencing here, they'll be experiencing there. So it's a live stream. Uh, of, uh, of our message time here, but yeah. uh, we're re really excited about that. We know, Joel, beyond just the uh, folks who live in Lake County and, and West uh, here, there might be some other folks who want to be a part of uh, kind of pioneering and, and, and uh, launching that new site. Yeah, and that's what we're praying about. Um, we sent those letters out a couple of weeks ago to the people that live out there. We're making the announcement today to say, let's all start praying about what God has for us involved in this this multi-site. Um, maybe you have an entrepreneurial spirit and you want to go launch something new. Uh, maybe you just want to be more missional um, than what you're doing right now. And so you have that opportunity in that neighborhood or out in that community. And so we're 
praying wholeheartedly for you and your influence and your involvement in what's to come. And we're really not asking anybody to make any kind of decisions about that right now. We're really asking folks to pray about that. Pray about it through the summer. We're going to come back in August and say uh, in August we'd like to identify at least a group of 150 to 200 people would be ideal yeah. to, to be like the core launch team. And we believe that will be the nucleus that God's going to use to expand and reach hundreds more people. And it's going to be a great uh, place uh, to do it in, in, in Lake County and specifically that, uh, uh, that facility. But beyond that facility, we're really not going to start our worship services there to January of 2014. But we have an office that's going to open up out there in August. That's right. It's right uh, on the main drag going into downtown Mount Dora. So on the corner of Donnelly and Limit Street. Uh, it's a little one-story house that was converted to a doctor's office, and now we're converting it into our church offices for Journey Christian Church West Instead of campus. treating bodies, we're going to start treating souls right <laughs> there. Right. Yeah, right. That's right. Um, and so we're, we're just preparing that and getting ready to move in over there in August. We're getting staff ready for that change, which is a huge change staff-wise as well, um, and praying about involvement around here. Yeah, our, our desire is it's one church, but it's multiple locations. And it's multiple locations, but it's the same message. And we pray the same vision and the same DNA that we have here in sharing uh, the gospel of Jesus Christ. I know this, what I've read about multi-site and the different ways that you prepare for that and what's needed to have a successful campus strategy. There's a lot that goes into that. But the number one factor that uh, lets you have a successful multi-site strategy is you've got to have the right campus pastor. And there's no doubt in my mind, Pastor Joel Craig is the right campus pastor to, to lead this. Uh, no, no doubt in my mind. And we, we, believe, we believe God uh, opened the door and brought Joel here from Illinois. And he and his uh, lovely wife, Christy, and their, their children, we're so glad they're a part of our, our team. And you'll hear more about this in, in coming weeks. But we want you to pray for Joel. In fact, I want to do that right now. Would you join me? And let's just pray for Joel. Father, thank you so much for the opportunity that we have to, to be uh, a part of uh, this new um, and fresh approach to ministry. At least it is for Journey. At least it is for this group of people that we're doing something that we've not done before. We're really kind of going beyond uh, uh, the box, so to speak, going beyond the campus that we have here and uh, really seeking to, to, to help impact other communities in, in a more direct way and uh, specifically west of here, specifically Lake County and, and, and regions around there. And thank you for Joel's heart. Thank you for opening the door for him to come and to be part of, uh, of our team here. We thank you, God, that, and I have every confidence that as he follows you, as he keeps following you, uh, that he's going to lead a lot more people He's going to impact a lot of lives, and a lot more people are going to take a life-changing journey with Jesus Christ, and we're so grateful for that. Thanks, God, for your favor. Thanks for doors that have opened. Thanks, God, for what you've done to go ahead before us. We have every confidence you'll keep doing that and help us persevere and to stay this path. And we look forward, God, to that time when Journey Christian Church West Campus will be up and fully running. We pray this in Jesus' name. We all agreed and said... Amen. Thanks, Joel. All right, let's give Joel a hand again.